Leader Chuck International showcasing EMO 2019, the JTO diaphragm chuck. Will, tell me all about them, please. Well, very pleased to be able to show you these. These are made by JTO in, uh, in Taiwan. They are a market leader in their, in their field. Uh, they are operated on a diaphragm system, which makes that extremely precise. Not only precise, but it can be held very, very delicately. So it allows you to use this chuck on some very, very delicate parts. What sort of materials? Any material, yeah. any material. But I'm thinking thin wall aluminium, ceramics. Absolutely, anything, anything like that. Kind of thing. So this one is turning, but what have you got there? Yeah, well, this is the, really is the integral part of the system because you need to know your air pressure. Okay. So once you get the air pressure right, which is controlled from that piece of equipment there, okay. you can then measure the force on the jaws. Okay. So if you need something extremely delicately held, you have a light pressure, very small uh, deflection of the diaphragm inside. Now I think, sorry about that, but if you could just get in there and just show the deflection, it's so small, it really is. If I just show you this, Chris, pull it out now yeah. and I'll operate it again okay, so not a lot going on there but that's the beauty of this system but the that's diaphragm exactly what it's all about okay. so this is for turning this is the turning the, the this one here on the milling um, again it's an ideal system for anywhere where there's a hostile environment there's n there are no m moving external moving parts at all so all you get is the diaphragm that's operating under pressure. Okay, now, so you said turning, milling, grinding as well then? Oh, grinding up, perfect for grinding. Okay. Um, absolutely perfect for grinding. Now, you've got these systems here. I presume these are the f fixture in plates here? Well, so, so the jaws here? Well, these, these are the jaws. This particular jaw is for holding internally. The system, the jaw goes on top of the chuck, it's bolted in. Once it's under pressure, Obviously, this particular one, you would, re would reverse the pressure, uh, reverse the system, because you're holding internally, so it'll be a halt on that. This is a, an example of external gripping. And in fact, I can show you, the, again, the very small movement on this particular model here. If you can just, just watch that guy, and you'll see it very, very slowly move. Okay, again, so perfect, really, really precise, small movement, so precise, delicate yeah. components. Yes, um, basically for any application, you can use it really for anything, but it is primarily for holding delicate components. And how is this, you've got air here, how is this driven? Is that the only option? No, they can be hydraulically um, driven as well, uh, but we here, it's just all there for obvious reasons. And all of these, I mean, e each of these, application specific so you just get in contact with yourself and you can get that absolutely absolutely it'll come complete okay well thank you very much a great little showcase of the jato diaphragm chuck thank you thank you